What's up, y'all? This be your boy, Scotty, and you're watching my review of the Bad Girls Club Season 10 Atlanta Episodes 13 and 14. What's up, you guys? Um, I, I did not do a video last week simply because I was bored by the show. Didn't want to do the video, so I didn't do it. Um, didn't do a video yesterday on the show like I was supposed to because I was tired and it didn't feel like doing it. But um, what I'm going to do is I'm not going to go by play by play. I didn't write any notes down, but I'm just going to discuss certain things that was going on that I feel like I want to discuss on both episodes 13 and 14 to just give you an overview of the season as a whole. Let's start off with them going to Greece. Now, this is after Rocky and Alicia had their fight. And I'm like I said, I don't like Rocky. I don't like Alicia. I don't like Shannon. And I don't like Valentina. I feel like the four of them can kill themselves for all I care. I don't even give a damn. I just want to see a good show. And everybody keep raving about how Rocky beat the shit out of Alicia on episode on the episode before they went to Greece. I don't think that... um. She just totally whooped her ass, like whooped her ass, but she whooped her ass. Like she didn't beat the shit out of her, but she whooped her ass like she was supposed to whoop her ass. You know what I mean? So, you know, that's all I got to say about this. So they went to Greece and, um, you know, Rocky and Shannon were having issues because, you know, Rocky ditched. No, Shannon ditched uh, Rocky to be with some man to go get fucked or something like that, I guess, and left her on the boat with a bunch of bitches that didn't like her. You know what I'm saying? And Rocky felt like Shannon wasn't being a friend to her. And I must say that Rocky, this is why I don't like Rocky. Rocky claims to be a bad girl, but she can't never stand alone. Like, she needs Shannon by her side. And true enough, Shannon is her friend, and Shannon is supposed to have her supposed to have her back or whatever but it just feels like she needs the bitch to stand you know to to be by her side like she can't stand alone worth a damn and i just don't think that that's a bad girl like if you constantly need somebody to be there for you and you can't stand alone then you're not no real bad girl that's just what i think so no nah, but she had every right to be mad at shannon because she left her on a boat with a bunch of motherfuckers that don't even like her ass. And I just don't think that is right for her to do that. You know, why well, she got her ass beat? I would have blamed her ass if I was Rocky. You know what I'm saying? So, they were playing games in Greece. And, you know, I think um, Shannon and Rocky won the rounds or whatever. And um, Alicia was still upset. Um, Alicia was still mad because of the simple fact Rocky um, had, whooped her, had whooped her ass. And she really wanted to get her back. And she was um, saying that uh, she don't know what she, you know, uh, she just want to fight her. She don't know what she want to do. She just want to whoop her ass and all of that stuff. And, um, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. That's what she, that's what she was saying. And that's what she wanted to do. And I just think that Alicia is a weak ass bitch. But I'm going to get into why I think she a weak ass bitch in a minute. Oh, just three minutes. Okay. Well, I got my phone right here. So I don't know how much more time I got to do. Anywho. Yeah, so um, when they get back from Greece, you know what I'm saying. Um, Alicia is talking about how she, when she get, when they get back to Atlanta, she gonna put her hand on some cornrows and she gonna try to pull a Nastasia and beat Alicia ass. But you know what I'm saying. Valentina felt like that she went to the very last day when everybody is leaving, and you know what I'm saying to whoop her ass, and that would have been a you know a more good a better idea. But you know whatever. Um, like I said, y'all, episode thirteen was so motherfucking boring that it didn't make no motherfucking sense. Like I really just didn't even tweet that much during episode thirteen. I don't even remember that much. I ain't even want to go back and watch the show because, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, God damn, if I sit back, if I come back and watch this show just to write some damn notes, my ass is going to fall asleep. And that's not going to be cool. That won't be a good look on my end. So, now, so getting on to uh, the next episode, the last episode, which is the finale, um, they decided that, you know, they're just going to take the last few days in the house and just try to get along or whatever. And, um, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. So, they decided that, you know, since we're going to leave, we're going to put all the petty shit aside and just try to get along or whatever. And, um, you know, and that's what they were doing. But this is what I got to say, though. Um, I feel like Stephanie is whack as hell. Um, and it's not because she never fought. Because of the simple fact, fighting doesn't make you a bad girl or a bad boy. But I forget that she's there because Stephanie really doesn't do anything. Like, I really do forget that she's even there. Like, 
why are you even here, bitch? You know, for real. Um, you know, Alicia, they went to go, um, they went to audition for some local rapper's video in Atlanta and all the girls decided that they wanted to audition as well. But Valentina and Alicia took themselves out of the equation or whatnot and they decided that, you know, they were just going to do judging. And then, you know, Shannon, out of all the bad girls, Shannon and Rocky were the ones that got picked for the video. And, of course, Alicia was hating. And let me tell you, on this episode, I'm not a flip-flopper at all. Because let me tell you, I can't stand Rocky. I haven't liked Rocky since she been on the show. However, watching this episode and watching how Alicia just kept taking shots at her and kept, you know, popping shit. I really felt like I really was waiting to see Rocky beat the shit out of Alicia. That's what I really wanted to see because of the simple fact Alicia, Fat Alicia is a fucking hater. And I really want, and you know, even though I don't like Rocky, I would have congratulated the bitch for making the damn video. I mean, bitch, you wasn't going to make the video. Look at look at how you made. Look at how you built. You built like a damn waffle. Bitch, sit the fuck down. You know what I'm saying? So, girl, get off. Just stop hating. You know what I'm saying? Because that's all the fuck you doing is hating. And it is what it is. So, after the video, you know, everybody was, you know, getting along and, um, you know, Alicia was like, um, after they got back from, they went to a club, I think, for a second. They went to a club for the last time. They went to a club opera again. This is the only club they wanted to go to, but they went to the club opera again. And then when they came back, Alicia was like, it's time, um, it's time for, for it's like, it's showtime. So they all went outside. And, um, you know, everybody in the house was outside. You know, they was enjoying themselves or whatever. And the next thing you know, Valentina, Rocky, and Alicia was out there drinking. And then she was like, cheers to the Bad Girls Club or whatever. So they they was like, cheers. Next thing you know, Alicia hauls off and punched the hell out of Rocky. And they fall back on the floor. And in a split second, Rocky throttles Alicia big, well-looking ass. She throttles her ass on the ground, get on top of her, punch the motherfucking holy shit out of that fat bitch. When I say that Rocky beat the shit out of Alicia, she beat the shit out of Alicia this time. Like, that first fight, she didn't really do shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, she, she like, you know, she pulled her head. She dragged her, punched her, like, two or three times. And then, you know, Shannon gave her that punk ass kick. But other than that, I really, I really, um, can honestly say that Rocky beat the fuck out of Alicia. And rightfully so. I'm glad that Alicia got her ass beat to fucking pieces that time. Because it's simple fact. She ain't nothing but a motherfucking bully. And she think that she can whoop everybody ass just because she beat Lil Janae ass. And then she had help doing that. Then, you know, she did jump on Rocky for no reason. Or whatever. And I just think that Alicia deserved the ass whooping. But her ass steady talking shit. But got her ass rushed out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, you tried to whoop this bitch ass or whatever. And you got rushed out at the end of the day. You really did get rushed out. Like, it ain't nothing you could do. You got the fuck rushed out. Like you got you like you tried to whoop a bitch ass, you tried to do a damn pull Anastasia and fail completely. The biggest motherfucking fail in Bad Girls Club history. You tried to pull Anastasia and you lost. You such a weak ass bitch. Bottom fucking line, you a weak bitch, and that's all I got to say about that. So after the fight, you know what I'm saying? Um all I gotta say is this though, before I get into the to the rest of it. Um, Nastasia, when Nastasia rushed uh, Shelly out the last night, she at least gave her five seconds to get up and defend herself. Your ass tried to sneak up and you got the fuck done up at the same time. You tried to sneak up on somebody and got your ass fucked up. Like, you are such a weak ass bitch. And then, you know, you got your ass all up on Twitter and you was talking all that shit, talking about, I'm trending. And I politely tweeted your ass and I told you that, bitch, you trending because you got your ass rushed out. That's why you trending, bitch. I'm like, girl, sit your motherfucking ass down. You got your ass rushed out and you got sent home. And so here go Valentina, um, dramatic ass, sit up here crying and shit like she was fucking a girl. I really believe that her and Alicia was fucking each other for the way that she be acting like, girl. And then, um... She was mad with Alicia. She didn't want to answer her phone calls or whatnot. And I just felt like it was real crazy. So then, um, later on, Steph and Andre, they decided that they're going to, um, you know, Stephanie said that she's not going to exactly, when they leave the house, she's not going to get on the plane to go home. But with that being said, she's going to spend um, the next, the last week with 
Andre and see where it goes because she really likes him. She hopes that, you know, they can take it further or whatever. So, um, what I was going to say, so then after that, you know what I'm saying, um, they were letting us, they were, um, they were going home, they were crying and everything else. And, you know, Paula and Valentina were the last girls of the house. And, you know, I love Paula, but I wish she'd get rid of the Mike and Ike ass eyebrows. Like, the, some, the Mike and Ike ass eyebrows are killing me. But, um, yeah. So, I, so that's all I can say about the finale in episode 13. Because it really was nothing to speak on. But I will say this, though. Um, my favorites out of this whole season would have to be Paula, Nicole, Jennifer, and Nancy. Those are my four favorites out of the, um... Out of this whole season. The ones I disliked the most this season had to be Valentina, Alicia, Shannon, and Rocky. I hated the four of them. Janae, I was indifferent to her. I really kind of wish that um, she we could have got uh, more of a chance to know her, but unfortunately we didn't. Um, unfortunately, they're making us wait two weeks to the reunion. They're doing the, um, the biggest OMG moments of Bad Girls Club history from season 6 to 10. Um, so that's why they have no way for the reunion. But as far as I'm concerned, eh, whatever. Um, I don't even think I'm going to review the first part of the reunion because it's going to be just like last season. They're going to be meeting up with each other, talking shit before the reunion. Then they're going to wait till like the last little 10 minutes to give us the, the actual reunion. So y'all might not get a Bad Girls Club video from me till three weeks from now. But it's up to y'all. Whatever y'all want me to do, just put it below. Um... Am I going to um, review Bad Girls Club, uh, the All-Star Battle? I might. I might not. I haven't made my, my decision. Until I see a trailer, then I'll make my decision. But with that being said, you guys, this is my review. Follow me on Twitter at www.twitter.com slash Mr. Underscore Still Standing without the G. My ex got an email. is Mrs. Still Standing at Yahoo.com. And my Instagram is King of the South 23. I'm out of here, you guys. Peace.